we go to the posterior calf, we find that most of the muscles there, the bulk of them, are um, the triceps suri. Triceps suri tells you that there are three heads to those muscles, to that muscle, that set of muscles. We have two heads to the gastrocnemius. We have a medial head on the medial side of the leg and a lateral head of the gastrocnemius on the lateral side of the leg. So here is the medial gastrocnemius, here's the lateral gastrocnemius. Now if I remove this whole set, if I just remove that from the leg, we will see that deep to those, here the two gastrocnemius are, deep to that we have what is called the soleus muscle. This is the soleus muscle, and we can see the soleus muscle when I remove this. Here's the soleus muscle deep to the medial head of the gastrocnemius. The whole tricep suri, all three of those muscles together, ends in the Achilles tendon right here, in the Achilles tendon. Um, <clears throat> we have uh, uh, several retinacula that we need to take a look at on the leg. We have the extensor retinaculum here, anterior on, anterior on the leg, and we have the flexor retinaculum back here. Those are connective tissue bands. Now if we go to the anterior lower leg, we will find a muscle that is lying right next to the tibia. That is called the tibialis anterior muscle right here. If there's an anterior, there must be a posterior, and indeed there is. Right in this area, you can see the tibialis posterior. Right there is tibialis posterior. We have several peroneus muscles. We have peroneus longus and peroneus brevis. Peroneus means fibula, so we look on it on the side where the fibula bone is, which would be lateral. So I'm looking on the lateral side of the leg, lower leg here. This muscle is peroneus longus. And down here where you see the fibers go a different direction, that's peroneus brevis, a smaller muscle. So peroneus longus, peroneus brevis. And the last one on the list for the leg is on the bottom of the foot or on the plantar <coughs> surface. And that is flexor digitorum brevis. When we're talking about the toes, if they flex, they're going to go like that. So here we have the muscle, flexor digitorum, digits or toes, brevis, right there. That's it for the foot.